Baby Daddy's guy said that. Uh uh. That's not even car type. Am I listening? <laughs> it's kind of. I bet she ain't gonna be saying F her baby daddy no more. She got a kid with her baby. I bet she ain't gonna be saying F her baby daddy no more. She's with her baby daddy. Like, don't get misled, baby girl. Alright, what's good, YouTube? I'm back with another video. We back on pace. I'm sorry for this little break. I just got a haircut. I wanted to be back fresh and good for y'all. Anywho, we got sexy baby. I mean, sexy red posts her baby daddy, but blurs out his face, as y'all can see. She finally posts a pregnant picture. She finally posts a baby. Apparently, this her baby daddy. She always talk about with her music. So we gonna get right into it. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe before we even get into this video. I love y'all. Chat family to my. I got a lot of videos going up for y'all today. Um, it's about it's late, but we still getting these videos up. I love y'all. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe for real, please. Anywho, we got sexy baby daddy, sexy red baby daddy. Uh, pause. Uh, but we gonna get right into it. I love y'all. Chat family to my. Let's do it. Let's get. Let's get it. Let's get it. <laughs> Christ. Okay, okay. What Jesus we Christ. About? Let's see what we talk about. Let's see what we talk I about. I will be honest with you. The more yeah, I see honestly, her, like they better these pictures better than what I would assume Sexy Red will come out with. Like, y'all just think of Sexy Red and think about baby pictures. Like these pictures way better, like, than we would assume. But I'm just gonna, she looks a little bit less like Young Thug. Like she still look ratchet. Yeah, I'm telling you, like she look good. So That's a compliment. Powder. I don't know what it is, but yo, she blurred this nigga face out mm -hmm. on some ill shit. Uh, okay, Rogers. I, I spoke about the restitution that G R was paid, one hundred thirty-eight thousand and five thousand. Oh, we can talk about that next. Don't forget, make sure y'all go next video. We can talk about that next. G Herbo getting out of jail, three year probation. Shout out G Herbo and he... Yeah. Yo, she, she dated a nigga who crap. she dated a nigga who is either heavily Haitian or you know what this is? Oh shit! Nigga, her baby daddy's guy said that. Uh uh, nah, bro. That don't look like I watch cut. I watch cut. Nah, hold up though. That could look like cut. It could look like cut. I'm not gonna lie, but we know it's not cut. Imagine if her baby daddy cut. Like that'd be crazy. That's not even. Nah, that'd be crazy if I said that. But that's not even cut type. Am I crazy? <laughs> let me keep. Let me just. Oh, Polo G. <laughs> Nah, it's Kai Sinat, bro. Yeah, he got a chest tattoo like Kai Nigga, that's Kai right here, bro. Yo, that is right. What the fuck? Yo, damn, Kai The only... <coughs> Yo, chat, so she deleted this, right? The most shocking thing about this, the nigga didn't have a, a ankle monitor on. Like, no uh, ankle monitor. Like, that shout out to him, then. Really though, did her baby daddy have no money? If me. it's the same dude, no if it's the same dude, that means he's doing his case. So that's good. Yeah. Yo, sex. Yo, sexy red. Hmm. Ah uh, no ads over here. No ads. Dates. Yo, you, you know I like sexy red too. You know she's like she's making a lot of money, but she still seem broke. Like she still seem broke. I like it. Mm. Ain't a lot. Sexy red. Now I don't know you think about it. She got hella songs out. Uh, F my baby daddy. Hellcats. That song with Drake. No, she got a few songs, but that the way they make her like she's probably getting a lot of money because they all coming like back to back to back to back. Like she's not having an off time, which is great for her, which is great. Like that takes a particular skill, and I'm not trying to diss her at all. I'm saying it's a good thing. She's still dumb relatable. Yeah, bro. For sure, for sure. You for know sure. she making probably like sixty, seventy thousand a show these days, bro. She still got that little Cartier that Drake bought her, nigga. She. <laughs> And she still got that fashion over top. For sure, though. She that does. same G-string shoes to wear back in the, in the hood. 
Hey, what size you wearing? Yeah. Hold up. She keeping it. What size you wearing? From. St. Louis, Missouri. They got hoods in St. Louis? Missouri? They got hoods in Missouri? The only thing I know about Missouri is literally it's a college. College football team out there. College. Yeah, it's a college. Missouri out there. They got hoods in Missouri? She from the hood, right? Pete, the only thing she probably like, you know, just changed out was her hair. How long did you gonna last, that? To you. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Because what happens is that people get really tired of, of like, a style of music. Right now, I think the going rate on each style of music is, like, a year and a half. And I, and, and I think she's, like, on her first year, if you ask me. Like eight months, really, not even a year. Mm. So what happens is all of these songs like Shake Your Dress, Shake Your Dress, oh, Shake, shake Your Dress, dress. Shake like, dress hard. that's cool. Or Fuck My Baby, that yeah, that's cool. So she has this chant type style, which it's kind of... I bet she ain't going to be saying F her baby daddy no more. <laughs> like she got a kid with her baby. I bet she ain't going to be saying F her baby daddy no more. That, that goes to tell y'all little girls that... Sing her songs and like that think that y'all could be what she is about F my baby daddy she's with her baby daddy like don't get misled baby girl like you're not a city girl you a regular girl and probably college working a regular job it's some real regular shit like for real though like I hate when people get misled and then come to find out they look stupid for real. They got misled bad because the person they getting let misled from living two totally different lives. Like, come on now, like, be for real with yourself, baby girl. I got, I ain't really get mad, but I'm just saying though, for real though, like y'all girls need to know that. Stop being misled, it's like you dumb assholes. New and unique, and she's the only one doing it. But what happens is in two years from now. When she's doing the same shit, people gonna be like, "Yo, this shit whack," and and really, it's not her more than it's them. People just move on from shit. Yeah, it's just a fucked up curry shit. Yeah, people move on from it. So, here's the thing though with her: if if she knows how to play her cards right, she'll do and and, and um won't fall victim to what the. City girls fell victim to man. Me. City girls fell. Oh, sexy red. Is, oh Lord, is now the epitome of a certain type of woman or a certain type of woman that want to act a certain type of way. Right. What that means is that once you become a symbol of something bigger than just your songs, you're gonna last. It's just can you remain relevant enough on the music side? That you're not just like a caricature of yourself, like because I think with the city girls now, yeah, JT just shout out Sissy really Red, bro. Shout out Sissy Red. <laughs> Chat, remember they were shout all shout out Sissy Red. Uh, shout out her, her baby daddy. Yes, little girls. I'm sorry, I keep smiling, but little girls stop being misled. Like she's with her baby daddy. She's taking pictures with her baby daddy, even though she covered her face. She posted her baby daddy for any other niggas to see. Like, y'all got to know that. Like, stop being something y'all not, y'all both. I love y'all, though. Girls make the world go around. All right, guys, remember that. Girls make the, girl, girls make the world go around. So, you just got to keep beating their walls. All right? Next video. I love y'all.